Juan Elifuno lived on the streets of Pretoria for years. His life had fallen apart. His leg was amputated due to bone cancer. He lost both his parents and dropped out of school. Drugs helped to ease the pain. Since the first time I arrived in Pretoria, I've stayed under this bridge for over six years. The thing forced me to stay here is the drugs. Pained by the plight of the young Kolani, begging at the same intersection for years, a compassionate businessman entered his life. And I decided I wanted to see what, what journey I could embark on with, with Solani. But I wanted to see what, what I could do with Solani and, and, and give him a chance. But a month in rehab didn't yield any results. With a new life beckoning, Kolani finally managed to break the habit. The reward was life-changing. He was fitted with a prosthetic leg. Leg, hey brother. I say thanks to that guy. Even another small guy is on the street. Hey, I wish lucky to him. Because I know that life, brother. I know I experienced to sleep outside. It's not nice when it's cold. Sometimes you never win every day, big guy. Employment followed. Far removed from his degrading days on the streets, Kalani now works at a perfume manufacturer. He's a very um, intelligent guy. Yeah, he's so special and he means a lot to us. From beggar to perfumer. No more stealing what what, no more do what what, right? a straight life. A Samaritan crossed his path. The investment has paid off. Marie Kate Amatabe, SABC News, Pretoria.